with Braun Strowman and Ricochet, maybe the unlikeliest duo, but can you talk about what this is going to mean for you guys? You know, and I'm going to say eventually becoming tag champs, having already hold champs, champions your, yourself. Oh, man, that's it, man. Walking into WrestleMania 1, what an opportunity. Just a couple weeks ago, yeah. we were uncertain if we were going to be on the card. You know, uh, I just recently came back to WWE, uh, short notice, still made the WrestleMania card. We got, like, Viking Raiders, some of the other guys. This is their first opportunity at a WrestleMania moment. They've been with the company. They've been working tirelessly, working their butts off to for this moment, and I'm proud of them as well and ourselves. Everybody that's going into this match, everybody's so deserving, and everyone's very dangerous. They're very dangerous tag teams no slouches there's no man when you look at top to bottom this match it's some of the best tag teams on the earth but you're looking at one of the newest and the best growing tag teams full round find out that's what we're calling ourselves that's what's going to happen this saturday if you don't believe us tune in i'll prove you wrong no i, no, I mean i don't know what, what else is to add to that i mean going into wrestlemania as a team with one of the most dominant people in wwe's history along with one of the most resilient one of the most Acrobatic, one of the most agile people in in the history. I think the re the what we have together. I think it's going to be hard pressed to find something, any team that's going to beat us. Especially if if, if we have a series, there's not going to be beat us in a series. Something might get lucky every now and then. Everyone's got a lucky day. Everyone can get a lucky punch. But I think between the two of us, there's gonna there's no team now, past, future, or present that's going to be as as dynamic as Braun and myself, as powerful as Don and myself, and just can really accomplish as much as we can really accomplish if we really wanted to. And ha having known each other, has that made getting the chemistry in the ring easier? Or has it been a little more pressure kind of like getting to this moment now? No, honestly, it's 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 uh, it's just kind of happened. It's yeah. flowed and it's just happened organically. That's just said. It definitely helps having the friendship that we have behind the scenes. And you know, the big thing that I've said in, in a bunch of these interviews that we do, while we're so different, athletic-wise, in our styles and our physical attributes, looking at us, we're so similar in our mindsets and our mentality towards the business, towards life, towards our work ethic. This man works tirelessly. You look at the shape that he's say, in. Look at the shape 20, this guy's in. And what he's in done. The business, always evolving, constantly adapting and where neither one of us have a weakness in our game and it's so cool that our attributes, our strengths, all they do is complement each other. Like I said, I can get all the stuff off the top shelf, he can get all the stuff off the bottom shelf. It's a match made in heaven. It's a match made in heaven, yeah, it's, absolutely, it's great. And then speaking on like this uh, kind of opposite, opposite society today, can you describe how Everybody can be different, but we're all the same. We should all just, it's all love. I mean, I think, I think that is just WWE in general. I think WWE message shows that everybody is so different. Of course, everyone looks different. Everyone dresses different. Everyone, you know, has different styles. Absolutely. Everyone has different styles of wrestling. Absolutely. But at the end of the day, we're all here for the same purpose. We're all here for WrestleMania. We're all here for WWE. We're all here, you know, especially for the talent, we're here to put smiles on your faces. So as, as, as different as we might look, even though as similar as we kind of look, as different as we may be, as different as our styles may be, like you said, our mentality is the same, our hearts are the same, our thoughts are the same, especially as far as what we want to accomplish here in the WWE, all that's the same. One of the most driven, one of the most determined people I know to be the best, and I want to be the best. And so now as a team, we want to be the best. And that's exactly what we're headed for. And that's totally our whole message in this exactly, is, is, is believing in not only yourselves, but believing in your partners, showing the world that it takes two sometimes to get through life. And I'm a firm believer there's no such thing as a self-made man or self-made woman. Everybody's had a hand along the way in their life to success. And right now, this man is leading his hand and my help, and we're looting into the future of success. And I got a big old hand to help. <laughs> and th this is Hollywood. This is Hollywood. What movie describes you guys? Oh, we're the twins. real twins, twins, but we're real life Avengers characters. And I mean, like if you really look at it, I mean, we're as close to a, oh, yeah. the Avengers as you can get. You're looking at the Incredible Hulk, and Black Panther maybe. himself, Spider Man, and and, and and let's be for real, we've been ripping off some of that stuff. We yeah. stole a move from Colossus and Wolverine, the Fastball Special. So yeah. that's what said WrestleMania, Los Angeles, SoFi Stadium, Team FAFO coming into the showcase wow. match. Let's go.